Hi everyone, I hope you're well. Today we're going to look at the diamond compressor and we're going to be um, checking out how that sounds with my Ned Steinberger violin. The um, diamond compressor is at the core or the heart of my pedal board. I actually have two of them. It's made in Nova Scotia. Um, love it. It's Canadian and amazing quality. And uh, but we're going to do something a little bit different. We're going to try this one out. Plus, we're also going to try the Diamond Compressor Junior. I actually have two of these. I kept the large one because I like it so much. And I presently now have the Diamond Compressor Junior in my pedal board. And we're going to basically AB these two today and just see which ones which one sounds better, uh, or if they sound identical, or I, I just I'm just wanting to compare the sound of both of them um, through my board. So we're going to do that today. Stick around. Hope you enjoy. Make sure you like this video. Make sure you subscribe to my channel. Thanks for dropping in. So to start, both compressors are off. We have the Diamond Compressor Junior over here and the regular Diamond Compressor over here at the beginning of my signal chain. And uh, this is very close to the beginning of my signal chain as well. And I'm, I'm just taking off my wah pedals not being used and my tuners not being used either. Okay, so um, here's my signal with nothing. Here's the regular compression. And I've got all of the settings, EQ, volume, and compression, all at 12 o'clock. Everything's going to be at 12. So we'll A, B the two. Here's the regular compression. Here's the junior. I'm going to put all the all the settings at zero and compare those. Guess we got to have volume up. Now EQ at 12 o'clock, compression all the way off. EQ at 3 o'clock, no compression. I will put I will put compression up all the way. Tried some um, plucking. Try this one.
you know, I think the Diamond Compression Junior Compressor Junior is a little brighter, so I'm going to roll the EQ off a bit. It's about equal now. I'm going to add reverb now and a bit of delay. And this is my regular sound. I, I like compression at about, you know, at about uh, 9 o'clock, maybe 10 is my regular setting for compression. I'll, I'll put it at 10 o'clock on both. And let's compare the two. Volume at about 12 o'clock on both and um, this is generally what I like to set my compression at when I'm playing and I've added a bit of reverb and delay now So here's overdrive without any compression at all. I still think there's just something about the regular diamond compressor that is a bit fatter and fuller, but it, they're still very, very close. And then why not? Both of them together. So there you have it. The Diamond Compressor. And the Diamond Compressor Junior. Please leave comments below. Like this video. Subscribe. Tell your friends. Really great to have you here. Stick around. There's going to be lots more videos coming. Thanks again.